wasn't done with the story. <laughs> Honey, are you are done? now. Are we done with talking about service tumblers? No, yeah, fish All right, yeah. this guy has a little speech impediment. <laughs> One of your best friends, I'm and he's sure. Checking it, yeah. I really like this guy. Yeah, I'm a boy. <laughs> so he goes into a hotel and he asks the uh, he walks up to the front desk and the guy said, "Can I help you?" And he, yeah, I'm in, I'm in the room. And the guy said, "What did you say?" And he said, "I'm like, in the room." And he said, "I'm sorry, I didn't understand." He said, "I'm in the room, you know, I'm in the plank when you put your head down on the bed in the room in the hotel, and that with the." Room. And the guy goes, "I'm sorry, sir, I didn't understand you. I'm I'm really sorry." And he goes, "That's okay, no, I'm okay." So he's checking him in. He said, will you be eating with us in our restaurant tonight, sir? And the guy said, oh, yeah, I love the restaurant. Yeah, I'm here tonight. Every time I come here, I eat at the restaurant. And the guy said, oh, he said, I just want to recommend. He said, they have some tomato bisque soup, and it is delicious today. And the guy goes, oh, no, I don't want the thing. I already know what I'm getting. I get a pork chop, I get a mashed potato, then I get a power crop. And I don't like the mashed potato and the power crop to touch on the plane, okay? And the guy goes, yeah, okay, well, whatever. I just want to tell you about the soup. And he goes, okay, all right. So he goes and checks it. He goes up to his room and he unpacks everything. And he goes down to the restaurant and he's walking in. And the major d comes up and he goes, one for dinner, sir. And the guy goes, yeah, yeah, one. He said, well, come right this way. So he's following him and the major d on the way to the table. He says, sir, I just want to tell you about our terrific soup of the day today. We have tomato bisque soup. And the guy goes, yeah, yeah, the guy told me about the soup. In the minority, know what I want. I like a pork chop, I like a mashed potato, I like a sour cup, and I don't like them dumping on the plate. I like them separate, okay? And the guy goes, yeah, okay, well, whatever. So he sits down, and here comes the little server, the little waiter, the girl with the water and the bread. She sits down, she said, oh, sir, I want to tell you, we have a terrific tomato bisque soup. And the guy goes, Gene, it's right with the soup in the plate. No, I already told you, I just want a pork chop, I want a mashed potato, I want a sour cup, and I don't like them dumping on the plate, okay? <laughs> the little girl runs away, okay, I'm sorry. <coughs> Here comes the waiter, and the waiter comes up, Yes, sir, how about starting off with a delicious cup of our tomato bisque and fucking fries already with the soup in this place. He said, I don't want the fucking soup, I want a pork cup, I want a mac and I want a sauerkraut, and I don't like them fucking on the plate, okay? And the waiter goes, I'm sorry, sir, and he goes away. He brings the food, the guy eats, everything's good. Come. So he goes up to his room and he goes to bed. A couple hours later, in the middle of the night, the front desk, the phone rings and the guy answers the phone and he goes, yes, yeah. yes, yes, and he hangs up and he calls the bell captain over. Yeah. And he said, hey, you know that guy in 310 that's always trying to get a girl in his room, somebody from the front desk, a waitress, a hostess? And he said, well, he has a bellyache tonight and he wants us to send somebody up with some medicine. He said, why don't you go up and give him an enema? He said, we'll see how he likes that. So the bell captain said, okay. So he gets on the elevator, and instead of going to the third floor, he goes to the second floor, and he goes to 210, where the guy with the... And he goes in the room, he flips the guy over in the bed, he shoots the enema up his ass, and the guy's fucking freaking out. He goes, what the fucking going on? What's going on? They're blaming You fucking people are crazy. I'm getting the fuck out of here. He starts packing his bags. He goes down to the front and says, get me the fuck out of here. That, you know, I'm checking you fucking people are crazy. There's a guy behind him. He's like, oh, sir, can I have your room? They were all sold out. Oh, you can have the fucking room. But I'm going to tell you that you go to that fucking restaurant. They want to give you the soup. Take the fucking soup or they come to your room and they shove it up your ass. <laughs> That's it. <laughs>